In this video, I'm going to show you how to use JB Weld. In fact, here's the finished product. I'm Eddie Field with Field Guide to DIY. Let's dive in. We have a chair that we bought online, and it's got a footstool for foot proppers like myself. But you can see the weld broke there, and the weld broke there. But there's no evidence of a weld there or weld there. So I'm going to put some JB Weld and uh, fix it right up. I'm going to line up the existing welds here and here with the holes here and here. JB Weld original formula. Hang on to your room keys and badges that you've had in the past. They make great epoxy mixers. So we're going to do four welds today. So I'm going to apply it pretty liberally. The weld. Even proportions. That's the activator. Now for the credit card key. Room key. I kind of mix this up the way I would mix concrete, you know. Pull, poke. Make sure all the black is gray and all the white is gray. Now we're going to apply. Scoop up our excess. This, this is for show. Just about see where it was. Right there. Scoop up some more. Scoop up some more. That's our spot. We can backfill it with this extra. Okay, now swing it back around. Like I said at the outset, we had hole there and a hole there that I'm going to line up with the bead that they had there. They only welded it on one side, so that was the downfall of this chair. Okay, that being the case, hold it up right there on the edge of the card. We let that set for four to six hours and we'll check it out. If you found this video to be helpful, be sure to like and subscribe. Field Guide to DIY.